Welcome back to Keeping Up With Cool. We're doing an online exclusive right now. We're hanging out with Will. He is the rhythm guitarist and vocalist of the band Hunter and the Bear. Welcome. Thank you very much. Thanks for having me. Now, you're considered a British-American country rock band. You're from the band called Hunter and the Bear. You released your new EP, Wildfire, back in July in the summer. Can you give me details about it? Yeah. Um, I mean, we... We wrote those songs uh, maybe at the back end of, of last year, um, and we, we were really excited to to record them and, and get them out in, in the public because we we've kind of been from from the start of this you know whole putting the band together and everything we've kind of been developing a sound and we feel like we've we've reached a, a point where we're actually really happy with with the sound that we're making now. It's kind of maybe taking a rockier step to the the stuff we started out playing but um it's kind of yeah we're that's exactly what we want to be playing and i think wildfire um kind of shows us in our true colors and so we, we were just really happy to release the, the ep and and to have people like yourselves listen to it and yeah, it's, it's been re received really well over here and that's that's can't ask for any more than that now what is one of your um favorite singles i guess to play off of the up for of that ep and um, what favorite to play yes um Ooh, that's a tough one. Um, I would probably go with um, Blood Red Skies, which is the uh, the last track on the EP. Um, it's kind of a slower one, but it gets, it's a real builder. It kind of starts starts really small, and then at the end, it's sort of this big, like, rocky riff thing. Um, and yeah, that we, we wrote that song um, about just some kind of um, history um, from Scotland that we were kind of reading about at the time and and it sort of yeah it seemed to stick with us and yeah i really love playing it it's, it's a big song and a really fun one to do live because kind of people always think it's just going to be a slow chilled out acoustic -y kind of song and then suddenly it really punches them in the face with a bit of a song <laughs> mm. now i've seen fine well your band you're when your band we're on tour with eric clapton recently right yeah that's right I gotta know that experience. And my mom, my mom, my parents were a huge Eric Clapton fan, so I've been listening to his music for a while. How was it? How was the experience on that tour? It was it was amazing. Um, it, it, honestly, it came out of nowhere. We were kind of playing uh, sort of small venues in, in the UK, and um, we we heard from our management that he was looking for someone to uh, support him, but we we didn't think in a million years that he would actually uh, choose us. So our, our music was sent in, and he kind of was looking for a, an up-and-coming UK band that he could kind of get behind a little bit and, you know, something that, that interested him, I guess. And, um, yeah, we just got an email one day saying, Eric has listened to your music and would love you to support on the UK UK tour. Um, so it was it was mad. Um, and we, we had about four months to kind of get ready for that. And we re it really kicked us into overdrive and we were just in the rehearsal room the whole time, you know, just trying to get as good as possible before we stepped out onto that arena stage and played in front of however many thousand people. That must have been crazy. I, I can't even begin to imagine what was going through um, you and your bandmates' like minds and hearts and like everything during yeah. that time. Yeah, it was it was mad. It was kind of a whirlwind of every kind of emotion. You know, we were terrified, but at the same time, we were so excited and happy to be there. Um, I mean, yeah, it was it was honestly one of the best one of the best experiences we've we've had as a band. It really kind of took us up a notch in terms of playing. Um, but you know, he his team and him were all so nice, and they really really seemed to enjoy what we were doing. So it was it was a really really cool experience all around. 